Imagine if a few simple adjustments to your website can significantly boost your revenue. Sounds too good to be true? It's not. Small changes in web design, user experience and content strategy can drastically improve user engagement and conversion rates. By optimizing your site's layout, enhancing its functionality and updating your content, you can create a more inviting and user-friendly environment that increases conversions. And in this video, we will delve into how these small changes can lead to unlocking the full sales potential of your website. Stay with me because in the end, I've got some pretty bonus for you. First thing, optimizing website for conversion. A site cluttered with information, too many CTAs, with no designed user paths can overwhelm your visitors. The main page and each sub page should answer the following questions. What is it? What do they have here? What can I do here? Why should I be here and not somewhere else? And where to start? And it's super important that you can answer these questions because your website should be functional for your users. And of course, it's worth conducting functionality tests that can be a real game changers. We did it a few times for our clients and the results were surprising, but also super helpful. And about functionality, you can read more in book Don't Make Me Think by Steve Crook, the link to which you can find in the description. And when we are talking about optimizing our website, mostly we are thinking about design and user experience, but the same applies to the content on our website. And it's not that easy as it seems, because on the one hand, we've got SEO, SEO best practices, keywords uh, research, competitor research, but on the other hand, we've got brutal reality. People need uh, quick fixes and quick answers for their questions and they don't want to read. Of course, not all of them. Therefore, it is always good to carry on an exercise, which is shorten the originally prepared text, let's say for your main page, by half and then half more. While we are talking about content, there's another thing. You have to create quality content that converts and quality content is one that provides value to your users and answer their queries. And content should be prepared on the basis of research. You have to do research, keyword research, topic research, your competitor research. Research is a key and you can do this with SEO tools like Ahrefs, SEMrush, SEO Minion or Senuto. Thanks to these tools, you can increase traffic to your website. And you can find video about six proven ways to increase traffic to your website right here. And before we jump uh, into another topic, don't forget to subscribe our channel for more helpful tips about sales, marketing and business growth. Another tip for you, if you want to make more money with your website, is utilizing data analytics to drive sales. You should collect data from your website. In my opinion, this is not negotiable. Based on data, you can make data-driven decisions. And let's be honest, they are the best. And if you don't agree with me, please let me know why. Okay, so how to collect data? There are plenty of options, cheaper and more expensive, of course, but I think there is a certain set of tools that can be considered sufficient to get started. And these tools are Google Analytics and Google Search Console. Thanks to these tools, you know how people get to your website, where they spend their time and what your audience is. Any SEO tool is a great complement to these two things. For example, SEMrush or Ahrefs, as I said earlier. And I believe that a tool that prepares session recordings, heat maps, and allow collecting feedback from your users also should be included in the set. And you can consider, for example, Hotjar or Crazy Egg. Last thing for today, apart from the bonus, that we should uh, talk a little bit more is social proofs and testimonials. In terms of sales and marketing, social proof can be a powerful Tool. It includes uh, customer testimonials, their opinions, reviews, expert opinions, user statistics, social shares even, 
all of which can significantly impact your sales. Because when potential customers see that others have had positive experience with your product or with your service, they are more likely to perceive it as a valuable and trustworthy, which in turn increases the likelihood of them making a purchase or convert. Essentially, social proof leverages the human tendency to follow the wisdom of the crowd. That's why you should have some social proofs and testimonials on your website. And in B2B, great example, in my opinion, are case studies and your clients' opinions. Okay, that's all from me for today. I'm kidding, I know that I have to tell you about bonus. And here it is. In the description, you will find a link where you can download a completely free sheet about transforming your uh, website into money-making machine. Get our cheat sheet to quickly learn how to improve your website and attract more customers. And make sure to let us know if this freebie was helpful for you. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We are here to help you stay ahead in the game of sales and marketing.